Hey, this is Gick and and Yoi. Or what's your name again? Yorigi. And this is something in the way. <laughs> trying to freak him out. <laughs> Bug? Well, I mean, Willy Wonka, you know. You know what they say about Willy? What? His name's Willy. He got that Willy. That's a fucking penis name. Oh. That is, <laughs> that is scary, but you guys want to know something equally as terrifying? What? AI! Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so Tim, you heard of that new AI enhancement? Dude, I heard of that AI uh, dick enlargement process. What? <laughs> Yeah, uh, man. I, I heard you can you can get an AI penis attached for dollars a day. So yeah, dollars. Just dollars. Me and Tim are wasted. Oh, we drove here in the pouring we, rain. Wasted. I heard you get that AI cock. We GTA uh, wasted. We are just we some did. local comics we on our way. We didn't get any cocaine. We're on our way. We're on our way to open mic tonight. It's not so nine eleven. It's not so happy nine eleven terrorists. Open mic. Open legs. You know. Today we got a very so. special guest, Tim. Tim? Hello. I'm special. And a guest. His first feature, second oh. guest. I hope I don't overstay my welcome. Yeah, you gotta go. Alright. <laughs> you gotta drive. Alright. 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 Don't tempt me with a good time. Yeah, How's it going? going? It's going. What'd you do? I learn? Learn? For a to class today. What'd you learn? Nothing. That's stupid. You like just it? Just do work. You like going to I, school and I like, learning nothing? It's going to make me money. You think? Stop doing that. But it's going to be an be engineer. Me. You don't tell them that. Uh, I mean, I will not be an engineer. That's <laughs> not what I'm going to school what if, for. Uh, you think they could engineer uh, the uh, fucking pair of fucking cock and balls? <laughs> engineering students. Tim's blackout drug. I saw a meme today. It was like engineering students when they say they won't help people build weapons, and it just shows like the Death Star firing. It's like once they show them like the seven figures, <laughs> that's you. Yeah. Are you gonna? That's make, me now. Are you making weapons of mass destruction? I'm making weapons. I'm making whoopee. That's for sure. Like new weapons. Making whoopee. You're like a. You're like the Nazis, bro. You're making new advances in technology for warfare. It's true. The Nazis did do that. But we're making so Dude, my friend. But Nazis weren't that they bad. They were eradicating the, the Jewish people. So, what's that got to do with it? Well, it's, it's I, I don't. That's I'm opposed to that. Anyway, I'm gonna go over my notes for tonight and see what you guys. You got notes? Yeah, I got notes. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous because I never. I'm a free ball. I'm gonna take my dick out. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start fucking. Whacking off. I never, yeah, I never really. My, my go to joke is just I start out, I start whacking off. <laughs> and then I fucking, I, I come all over the microphone. <laughs> and then the, the real punchline doesn't hit until the next comic has to How many to of those have you had, bro? And uh, <laughs> I've been talking to my cum covered mic. <laughs> not, even, not even a hole in so far. Yeah, yeah I usually open up with them here so I don't beat up my girlfriend and my therapist that I needed creative outlets. <laughs> Pretty good. I'm a disappointment. <laughs> Life's full of disappointment. Like I recently just found out what pedophiles are. This whole time I thought they were genies. Because you'd rub them and then grant your wishes. They weren't genies. They were pedophiles. <laughs> I was raped. <laughs> I wasn't fucking paying attention. Life's full of disappointment. Growing up, um, I always thought we were getting a dog because my mom would scream every night, I want doggy, I want doggy, and then I'd wake up every morning and there's no dog. Anyway, did you hear, um, we're gonna have to bleep this out, did you hear, uh, we got married? Yeah. 
Yeah. Gonna need to bleep that out. That's fine. Um, she's run through uh. everyone. <laughs> Not me. Seems like just yesterday she was asking me how long my pee pee was. No. In French class. Now he's asking. Now I'm up. <laughs> now he's asking how big her pee pee is. Huh? No, she just likes black guys. What's so bad about that? Nick's racist. Well, she's married to a white guy. Ooh, wanna hear my black people joke? Yeah. I uh, I think it's uh, I think it's I think it's funny how um how people like people will shave their head in solidarity with cancer patients to show their support. But the second that I put on blackface and go to the BLM fucking march, all of a sudden I'm racist. <laughs> I wanna pull up I wanted to pull up to that wedding. I wanted to crash that wedding so bad. You wanted to be like, don't do it! It's a trap. <laughs> that's what you that's what you want to do to help. Anything you related to this, we're gonna have to bleep out. And I mean, my, it's not gonna be hard. This is my roommate Bryce. What's up, guys? Hey dude. How you doing? Some comedy we're doing a podcast right now. You're on air. Sick. How's it feel? Nice. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we're getting silly. Price is, price is kind of sad because I'm moving out. Oh, that'd be sad too, G. You can't come on my couch anymore. But hopefully there isn't like an obvious AC noise for the whole time. Oh, there definitely was that whole time. It's soothing. I have this whole bit about that. Japanese men. It kind of doesn't make sense. The Hiroshima one? Yeah, I was yeah holding, we heard it. Well, no, I was holding the door for this Japanese oh. guy the other day. He said, thank you. So I punched him in the face. <laughs> Bringing up Pearl Harbor like that. Get it? Uh, Thank you. That's fine. That's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's good. He didn't know where it was coming. He didn't know what was coming. He didn't know what hit him. It's like, don't make me fucking come back there. Do you understand? Oh, fucking man. Two nukes. We gave you two nukes. Don't make us come back over there. Fucking old man. How many times do we have to teach you this Is lesson, this old man? man? I love the young people. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. I have this bit about granny trainees, how there's going to be a whole epidemic granny of granny trainees. Ooh. That's going to be a whole new genre right there. Like, now there's boomers, and now there's going to be granny trainees. Granny it's going to be our generation. And yeah, then they're going to be complaining about how bad their dick hurts. It's going to be a fucking DVD special. It's like, Grammy, stop complaining about your penis. Stop talking about it like it's a bad tattoo. <laughs> that's pretty good. Yeah. I like that. Anyway, that's not what I'll be doing tonight. I'm just saying, I'm new shit I'm trying out, but I'll throw some of that stuff in, sprinkle it. Yeah, I'm, I'm always so nervous before, I mean, I've only done it like twice, but pretty you know nervous up until I actually go up there. I mean, right? <clears throat> if that helps. Do you usually write your rap songs? No, no, I don't, not really. It's happening. Some high. That could be just you. Yeah. Like, they could, you just, you could freestyle. You gotta have a little bit of nerve. Sometimes I'd be writing rap. I've written jokes before, but I read them and I'm like, how the fuck am I supposed to say this? What the fuck? I just have stories in my head that I want to talk I just, about. It's like I therapy. Just, I just talk. I just talk to people and then if it's like funny, I'm just, I just go, yeah, that could work. And I'll just write down the concept and then I'll like word it out as I go. Because yeah. it's probably going to sound like shit at first. But like, as you like, if the concept is there, it's probably a good joke. You just have to word it. So like, I say it. open mics are kind of like AA meetings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just all a bunch of degens. <laughs> Did you think about it? Like, who's actually in their right mind going out to a comedy, watching amateurs do stand up? Who's in the right mind? Who's in, mind the who's in the right mind? True. Damn, bro, you always get so deep and sentimental <laughs> when we just try to have a normal <laughs> conversation. I've come to the conclusion that like everyone's crazy. There's no such thing as crazy. Dude, no, I'm not. Motherfuckers who aren't crazy, you make me really hell uncomfortable. It's crazy. <laughs> and then he takes this picture. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good one. Dude, Tim is not funny. Tim. <laughs> yeah, this Tim, your Instagram is Tim is not funny. That's why I gotta, I gotta set their expectations low. Yeah. yeah. He's like, you gotta sag off. He's like, I wasn't, I wasn't gonna plug the Instagram, but, uh. Dylan, Dylan shares me your stories. And it's really <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Tim's fucking stories, bro. It's like a Bible verse. Dude, I know. I'll be posting my stories, and I'm like, oh my god, I'm so fucking retarded. What am I? 
And then somebody, every once in a while, some, some random person that I don't even know very well will be like, hey, I, I'm sorry if this sounds weird, but like your Instagram stories are like the only thing that is making me not kill myself. And you're like, yeah, for real. What? For real, they are entertaining. What did you, I wanted to, you had a pizza bagel? And you put a burger on it and put oh, garlic yeah, in it or something? Crazy. That was nuts. That was hard. What? That was that like, did go hard. I made like a pizza pizza burger. I took like a bun and then I like turned the bun into garlic bread and put like fucking tomato sauce and shit on it and the fucking pepperoni and I put a burger in it. Oh my god. I wasn't oh, fucking paying attention. I'm gonna go. <laughs> that did look oh. fucking busting. That was she. Did you know they brought back the maple bacon sandwich, the dunks, and I was like, she Oh yeah, I remember that. I don't eat dunks, though. Dunks is like me. In fact. <laughs> you come to me girthless on Fat Guard Friday. What's <laughs> on Friday? So, this is take two of the of last night. We tried recording last night, but it was too noisy. Yeah. Right? So we have to reiterate whatever we said on that record. Quick, play it back. I feel like it's like a... It's a vibe check, too, dude. Like, in here, this is gold. Just have a spot to chill. Be nice to have it on camera. <laughs> it's like a casting couch. And we're over yeah, here. too bad I'm moving. It's like, it's like the casting couch, except I'm the only one who's hard right now. <laughs> but, um, cha. Speaking of casting couch. <laughs> oh my god, dude. You're gonna make me dissect this podcast. I know. That's okay, though. I like adding attention to detail only on this podcast. I feel like our lives are boring, dude. We don't even have anything I don't, to talk I about. I don't get cucks. What? Cucking. I mean, I've honestly, I've been like, yeah. Letting, that, your, that, letting your woman train a bunch of black guys? Yeah, like, it's been like, damn, that is kind of hot. But I'm also like, nah, dude, like, it's like a facade. Like, I wouldn't actually be. What's hot about it? it? I don't know. It's just like... Oh, it's cool if you're into it. I just want to know. I mean, I'm not really into it. It's never happened to me, per se. Yeah, you don't know yet. You don't know. There's something elusive. <laughs> There's... No, I have known because I've seen... I, I've been in a relationship well, where I let my girlfriend make out with other people at the party. And like, I don't, I'm just like, oh, cuck? I just get well, angry. you're talking about trans women. No, a cuck. Yeah, you're on Instagram. Yeah, no, that's can't a, take well, there's, Instagram. Well, there's hey, there's I'm just I'm just texting the shot. Well, <laughs> there's a, there's a different uh, there's a difference between hot wifing and, and uh, cucking apparently. Because there's like being a cuck is like oh I, I only get off if I'm being like emasculated. But then there's like hot, there's like hot wifing where it's like your wife is super hot and you like want other dudes to fuck her and watch and it's like. You're like, hell yeah, I got a hot ass wife, like everybody wants to fuck her. Yeah. And apparently, apparently no. I, w- I wouldn't I wouldn't know because neither of those are my thing. Yeah. But I don't but think they're anybody's thing. They're two different things. Yeah, so they so well, they gotta be somebody's thing. Am I right? Well, that, a Blumkin has but to be somebody's thing or else it wouldn't be a I was, Blumkin. I was listening, well, I mean, who doesn't want their dick sucked while they're taking <laughs> shit? Just, oh, man. And the bidet at the The smell, smell good. That's, that's like. The smell, though. Well, I but that we cannot get yeah, fired while popping my own shit. But that's, shit. That, that's part. That's part. Of, that's part of what's probably so like appealing about it is like, damn, this bitch is like getting off sucking my dick. Meanwhile, she's smelling my shit at the same time. <laughs> like, she, 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 like, like, yeah, she must really. She must really be fucking with my dick. With the she kid, gonna, bro. She, she gonna ride it like that, oh, man. She really mm. fucks with you, bro. I feel like there's like six people who are into that. Yeah, including the person who came up with it. So and there's like five are, apostles. Two of them are in this room. So, good luck finding the rest. So probably in Indo China, <laughs> doing cartwheels on the top of buses and shit. Those fucking people who do Blumkins definitely do Jankum. <laughs> yeah, I've wondered about that. I I don't know. <laughs> I mean, such a doesn't, funny name. Probably get you high as shit. <laughs> Inhalants, bro. Inhalants are bad. Cause. You can just fill up the bag and Yeah, but like, what type of high is it gonna be? Is it gonna be like a disreality? Um, I'd imagine it's like a whippet. And you're like, you're high for like, maybe 30 seconds. And then you're like, oh my god, like, I gotta keep doing these. What's a whippet? Remember that last episode at my house? And Derek was like, like oh yeah. That. It's like that, except you suck on it. And like you get in, up your nose? Not in your mouth. Yeah, but what's the high like? It's like, 
It's like you dissociate for like two minutes and then you're... Yeah, you get like maybe like some tunnel vision. And you kind of just be like... It's kind of weird. It's almost like super euphoric for like such a short amount of time. But then you have to do like a shit ton of them because you're like, well, I got to get back up there, dude. No. How about... No. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't no, fucking no. paying attention. I'd vote don't. I did like 30 of them. I wasn't fucking around. paying attention. But no. Not a good time, I don't think. Unless you can pick it up and put it down. Unless you're strong. Dude, you guys are on Reddit texting. Dude, I'm on Reddit texting. Why you gotta text, bro? Because I got a notification. I'm silencing dude. it. This isn't a real podcast, dude. This is fucking happy hour over here. Tim's wasted. Nick's got a sitting wasted. on his cum. I could drink about 15 more beers. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get drunk. I'm on edge. Yeah, let's get drunk. I think I'm gonna get drunk. Let's get drunk. Nick, do you have this? The, we should make a podcast where it's just people arguing all the time. <laughs> you never listen to my podcast. I don't think I have drunk. Damn. I'll check. Let me see if I have drunk. Yeah, I think we need to get the drinks in motion, dude. I think I have like three dollars. <gasps> On that note, I'm trying to get a loaf of that fucking honey ass. Well, we'll handle it to oh, well, that oh, might do the job. Can I take a sh- <laughs> Can I have some? You want some? Let's all do yeah. Alright guys, um, we're gonna take a second and not do drugs. And we're back. Please don't tell me you're huffing whipped cream. And we're ben. back. Not on the mic, Ben. Dude, honestly, I used to laugh at that kind of shit. But then I met a lot of friends well, dude, who were like, like any. That's like, <laughs> that's like any drug, man. You, you look down on it. So, you know. Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, that thing looks fucked up. <laughs> you guys like Domino's? No one really likes Domino's. Kind of, it kind of gets hard too. real quick. Yeah. Is <laughs> that from yesterday? Oh, man. It's from two days ago. Oh, wow. It's already oh, cardboard. Ew. You put it in the oven. I'm no. in the fucking oven. Hey, hand. man, that's anti-Semitic, dude. <laughs> Ari Shafir, dude. Yeah. I like cold pizza. I, I, when I was, like, selling fucking a bunch of weed at school, bro, I, I probably spent fucking thousand dollars on Domino's. Because it was the only place to deliver, <laughs> it was the only place to deliver to my school, so it was, like, mm. fucked up in the car, I'd be like, you know. Don't get too free to live. <laughs> pussy, pussy. Not to me. Oh. No. Over that's why that's why the delivery driver gets oh, like fucking a fucking attention. dollar tip. Yeah, I remember doing I went to Vermont oh, with Tim and stayed out of school for a little bit and I was like trying to make money while I was there, so I did DoorDash and I was just going back and forth from like God. McDonald's and fucking Dunkin' Donuts and that's it. You're in the mountains. I mean, those are the only places they got. That sounds cash. They got the tea bell. Sounds like a good time. You yeah. Should. Cruising. It wasn't good time, but that's the, that's the thing about something like DoorDash for me, though. If I don't have like a boss or like a weekly check, I'll just fuck off and be like, "Nah, I'm not working." <laughs> Tim, are you okay? I got, I got. <laughs> you okay? You yeah, Ben? No, he's not gonna throw up. If I if I was gonna throw up, I'd know it. You'd see it and be on the floor. Yep. Tim's not a pussy. I wasn't fucking mad. Nick just in case. Because Nick is the best. Nick just in case. I also gave him like probably two shots. Oh. Probably get. <laughs> Tim's gonna kill it tonight. Is this what open micers do? Uh, well, yep. <laughs> they just get wasted and go tell Joe. Yeah, I moved to New York. We got we had a fucking place in New York. Doing it every night. But I'm friends with them. That's the thing, if you're in a big city, you become friends with all the, like, the styles comics. Right. Ugh. Woo! New York's a place. I'd be yeah, down to go visit. Hit some mics, dude. <laughs> I've been down there, dude. It's a fun place to, like, pop out it's, and do uh, some music It's shit. 90 proof, so. It's. Mm-hmm. That's how it's cool supposed to be. That's the shit that cures cancer, my boy. 100% A, Dave. That shit cures 100%. 
That must say. Oh, <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> well, well, We're going to have to fucking cut that out. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 right. that was bad. That's a lot of fucking right. attention. Moving on. Oh, man. Feels good. You need a fucking piece of bread. I don't want to. Piece of bread? <sighs> Yeah, my school brother used to, uh, <laughs> every time they had a party, they'd, like, order a bunch of, with school, order a bunch of breadsticks from a pizza place and bring them in. This would be a fun episode to film, because every five seconds, Tim's just film. <laughs> <laughs> what about the breadsticks, buddy? I mean, uh, he's got <laughs> I'm gonna kill Tim. You got an ad for some pants. I'm gonna kill Tim. I got, I'm, I'm texting this one, uh, Mama Sita. Some some corny ass shit. I yeah. want to come out tonight, dude. I mean, it's gonna be awful. She's gonna do all the work. My girl, she's gonna hurt. She's Let's bring that. the open mic to her. Yeah. She's she's just school to be a nutritionist, you know? It's like, if you're gonna date me, you gotta find some kind of job to really hold it down for <laughs> two people. <laughs> <laughs> Tell her to take notes, dude. This is you're doing, uh, well, you host an open mic. I do. They pay you for that, aren't they? Nope. <laughs> no. I've been meaning to check out. When, when's your open mic? It's it's ev- it's once every fucking month. <laughs> but then everybody that that inquired about it, they gave the job to. So it's like there's three other hosts too. <laughs> so I guess I'm hosting it like like three times a month. Oh <laughs> wow. no. But still, you know, we should. I can put it on my resume. I'd be down to go there and do stand up. You know? Should I? You cool. host it. Wait. Say that again. So there's like four other hosts yeah. doing it the night you do it? Yeah. Or you only have one night you no. do it solo? Yeah, so so I hosted the first one. I yeah. think there's another one that's happening, maybe happened yesterday that somebody else hosted. And then next month. But I also talked to him. I was like, yo, we should get this going more than just once a month. Like, I'll host him. So. We'll Those see. that don't know, we'll that's happens. at the Portsmouth Button Factory. And if I'm going, I'll post it. Tim will post it. Follow us. And then you'll get noted. Nick might even post it. He's not busy fucking getting pussy, dude. He's a fucking animal. He's got a picture of himself. For those that don't know, Nick has a picture of his dick on his wall. (laughs) Just kidding. But he does have 18 guns in his closet that could fuel him. I have 18 shit. guns and a picture of my dick. So I just want to <laughs> let him know. <laughs> if a girl comes over, gotta let her know. I gotta let him know. I'm not about telling secrets Facts, in this bro. household. It's like, imagine you're fucking a bitch and you like, can't get it up. You're like, oh man, this isn't what it's normally like. Look at that on the wall. That's... <laughs> It's like, I'm sorry, I'm not going to be able to satisfy you tonight, but if you just want to, like, lay down and, like, finger yourself and, like, look, look at that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that comes in handy. You ever just, like, have a girl be like, just masturbate to me face to face? That's a vibe, bro. It's pretty intense, dude. It's or on like, FaceTime. You feel like such a bean, Oh, yeah. Just flicking the bean. No, nah, like, you you have to like, oh, to that. Expose your asshole to me. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of a vibe. It is kind, kind of a vibe. Of, it's very exposing, It makes me feel like... I feel like people are afraid of that kind of stuff, dude, to be vulnerable. Me? I'm getting pegged in the woods. Dude, you like cucking. I swear. I don't know, dude. If it was, like, actually my girl, though, I'd be kind of, like, bumming. I know I would. Dude. That's not alpha. It's not. Well, do you want to cuck so or that, hot wife? Do you want to not Do you want to? It's not either be, cuck or be cucked out here. It's <laughs> <laughs> For real. You either I've been you cucked. Know. But then the cucker also got cucked. But so. she, didn't, you, she didn't fuck him in front of you. Isn't that what that means? Uh-huh. It's just funnier to say it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you could exaggerate that for a bit. That'd be good. Be like, I literally paid someone to fuck my girlfriend, and I felt terrible about it. I paid somebody to come do it because she was ugly as fuck. Dude, I think that's what... I- <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to just... I'm not even going to, like, say jokes tonight. I'm just going to act and just be like, Dude, like, last night someone, like, asked if, like, they could fuck my girl, and I just, like, gave them money for it. And then, yeah, I'm just going to act. It's going to be like a, I'm auditioning for a movie. It's not going to be like a stand-up. And people are just going to be like, dude, is this guy serious? 
And then I'll like cry. Mom. And then I'll be like, don't worry guys, I was just kidding. With you guys after. And then you'll be like, dude, who is this guy? Is he real? Oh, dude, I was watching The Office, bro. You guys ever watched The Office? Yeah, yeah a couple times. Me either, because that shit's dumb. You don't watch shit that's cool. All I can think of is that Cam Patterson bit from Kill Tony. Mm. It's just like, this bitch took my dick so good, I started watching The Office. <laughs> <laughs> that's like a thing a rapper would yeah. say on a song now. Fucking RXK nephew. I was like, this, this bitch on my dick so good, I started watching The Office. <laughs> yeah. I was fucking this, I was fucking the temp at the fucking office. <laughs> I was up in the filing cabinet getting my dick sucked at the office. <laughs> this bitch sucked my dick so good I got a paper cut at the office. <laughs> she gave me a paper cut on my dick at the office. Yeah. <laughs> bitch sucked my dick from the back of the office. The real Scarface. <laughs> everything's from the office. A <laughs> paper cut fits up at the office. But back to no, I was saying I'm saying that bitch rolled my dick up like a roll of tape. Wouldn't it be <laughs> wouldn't it be fun to <laughs> She used the stapler on the uncircumcision. <laughs> now I'll never pee again. <laughs> but wouldn't it be fun to act in like a, a skit like skits like the office where it's just like yeah, almost yeah. like always sunny in Philadelphia type Let's shit? Do it. We gotta shoot a pilot. That'd be so much we gotta fun. Dude. Show, shoot a pilot. <laughs> be so much fun. <laughs> okay, this you is roll my dick like a roll of tape. Dude, this she, is, she rolled my dick like a rolling chair at the office. This is, this is the bit. This is the skit. She so, was riding my dick like that bitch was on the office. Yeah, what? <laughs> <laughs> just get drunk as shit and just start saying that, like everything ends with the office. No, I think we gotta ghost write a, a song and send it to our ex nephew. Dude, like, here's your next song. This is the this you is the, my mind. this is the skit. So, Wrestling. we're just bait. We're oh basically just. We're just baiting. We're just normal. <laughs> we're basically baiting. <laughs> we're just normal. <laughs> we're basically just rubbing our fucking dicks. With it. <laughs> oh, <it's>, uh, <laughs> imagine you're working an office job and you're like the last one to leave. How many times? How many times? How many times? <laughs> <laughs> what are you know what I'm going to say? The last person to leave is like, alright, everybody else is gone. Looks like I'm a jerk off. Like, I'm gonna fucking come all over Mindy's family pictures. She's like, yeah, she's not gonna know in the morning. Like, yeah, Mindy. Oh, yeah, Mindy. <laughs> Have you seen the reviews? That sounds like the reviews. You know that red, milk, like that red convenience store in Exeter. Yeah. Have you, seen, have you looked up the reviews for that? Yeah. It's like the guy won't let me what down the it? second aisle because he might. Be you can see me whacking off. <laughs> what? Wait, what, what place is that? <laughs> the, 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 like the red convenience store in Exeter. It's red, off like of, actual color red? Yeah, the brick one. Off of Kingston Road. Next to the purple dinosaur. Purple dinosaur? Purple yeah, dinosaur, purple dinosaur playground. No, in Exeter. It's before... It's like, guy won't let me down yeah, the second aisle. Yeah, it's like Yeah, okay. Is that what it's called? It's called red? <laughs> It doesn't, it doesn't look no, right. it's called. It's called. It's, it's called. Red. I don't know. My my, my, my dad used to red. call it the Packy. Packy. He's from Connecticut. He must be from Connecticut. It's an Indian guy oh, who yeah. owns the place, and it's like the oh. owner like won't let you down the second aisle because you can see his office. And oh he's yeah. jerking off. Worst dude. Worst. <laughs> oh. Worst Aki. That's just such funny fucking reviews. Yeah, I was like, can you put this on the grill? And he was like, no, I'm not gonna put this on the grill because I don't even have a grill. And I was like, damn. You can't put the pop tart on the grill, Aki. <laughs> <laughs> You, you know it. You know it's a bad convenience store when you go in there and you're like, "Will you put the pop tart on the grill?" <laughs> you're like, "Hey Aki, can I get a can I get a bacon egg and cheese on a pop tart with a honey bun and, and a couple fucking rhino dick pills sprinkled on top?" <laughs> if you ain't trying to give me that, then just slide it. <laughs> nah, bro, it's shell full life. Yeah, facts. Bro, they should get, dude. Imagine how much shell would make. If they got a grill in there and start making sandwiches and shit. Mm. Or sir, that's how we get. That's how we get the food truck going. We're like, let us post outside here. We just get like a camp stove and fucking cook up. Dude, you ever, see, you ever seen people actually buy like the food from the shell though? Dude, I almost did. I was. Yeah, like, I saw you looking at. I looked at the hot dog. I was like, you know, I got a hot dog from here, and then I look, I looked at it for a minute. And I was like, this shit has been spinning on here for like five weeks. <laughs> but maybe I should have. Maybe it would have been. 
<laughs> it wouldn't have been a Oh, no. Oh, Nick, you gotta come back to Exeter, dude. You're missing. Yeah, gas know. station <laughs> hot dogs be hidden. Like a Circle K hot dog, sometimes that should be hidden. <laughs> the lore of Exeter <laughs> is fucking out of pocket. I know. It, I want to experience deep. Tim's stories, like, in deep. first person. <laughs> yeah. I'm only experiencing the third person. It's, it's very overwhelming. It's just like... It's, it, like he just makes going to McDonald's seem so exciting. He's like, "Yo, I'm going to McDonald's," and then it's like, it's like four pictures of him in McDonald's, just doing shit. <laughs> You're so right. I don't like. I, it's impossible to explain why that's funny, but it's just funny. <laughs> it is. Tim will live forever through his Instagram. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's kind of like DJ Khaled when he just says shit. And it's like impossible to, to explain why it's funny, but just. And Tell him to bring out the whole ocean. <laughs> it's call funny. Me, what does he say? Call me, uh... Life is like Roblox. <laughs> did you see the chandelier. What's that? Did you see that? What did you see that? Something. I was with my friend. I was like, um... Bring out the whole pasture. <laughs> bring out the whole pasture. Yeah. It was in this post. Tell him to bring out the whole pasture. I was doing some DJ Khaled, though. Tim's basically Exeter DJ Khaled, except yeah. he's actually <laughs> exactly. talented. Every town has a DJ Khaled. <laughs> <laughs> actually, honestly, that was that, that was a bad remark. Me DJ Khaled probably did. Did I ever show you that? Yeah, that's fucking sick. He looks so. Wild. <laughs> look at, yeah, right. Oh, I was looking at, but I'm look at look at the dark circles under my. Somehow the dark circles under That's my you? eyes are like crazier. Yeah, yeah you me, like don't. My have dad, like my dad used to do yoga at the blue moon, and then I. Why start, are you doing this with your teeth? <laughs> I don't know. It's <laughs> 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 little. Apparently, I looked more strung out in drugs when I was like twelve. For those of you <laughs> listening, he's like he has a massive underbite going on in that picture for no reason. Really he looks like Shane Gillis. For no <laughs> reason. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a pedophile. <laughs> I'm the world's first child pedophile. Bring out the whole pasture. Bring out the whole pasture. And what is this? Bring out the whole pasture. Bring out the whole pasture. Tell him to bring out the whole pasture. Let's go to the beach. Let's <laughs> do some Tell him bring out the whole ocean. And what is this? And what is this? <laughs> and what is this? And what is this? <laughs> and what is this? <laughs> Tim is not funny. Dude, Tim. The biggest lie. Never been funny. The biggest lie he's ever told. Oh is his God, Instagram handle. I'm serious, bro. Look at Kino, bro. Seven. I hope you go have sex with yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tell this dude to have sex with himself. I keep forgetting it's 9 11, dude. Facts, man. <laughs> hey, September 11th. I just I drank mean, away I my whole set. <laughs> I'm just gonna be up there burping the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> the craziest Nobody stuff. takes me seriously. Nobody's paying attention. I'm like, I'm throwing up. Oh my god. There's always that one girl that says it under her breath at the party. Yeah, where she's just like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw up. And then nobody pays attention. It ruins the whole rug. Yeah, and then in the morning you're like, dude, who could have done this? Who could have done this? It's like Obi Wan <laughs> at the Jedi Temple. Who could have done this? Who could have done this? Oh! <laughs> like flashback to last night. It was you. Yeah. It's me giving her the lightsaber. Mm. And then she throws up. Mm. She feels it in her gut. No, Obi Wan, I'm the top guy. Mm, smoking Dagobah breeze. <laughs> <laughs> Luke. I don't know. I don't know how that song goes. I don't know. Goes. Anymore, dude. I don't know. Rebels. Let's just light my whole apartment on fire. <laughs> yeah, I don't good. Fucking yeah. <laughs> Lose everything. I'll take it. Nick just signed off his lease to me. Huh. Yeah. If you want it. He signed it off to me, the gayest guy in the room. Huh. Imagine what I could do with I only sign I only sign stuff off to gay people. Because I like gay people. I don't like pretty girls. I just like gay people. <laughs> but I'm not but you're not But I'm not gay. Oh. That makes sense, you know. 
That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not gay. Well, better be gay than being a cuck. Well, at least if you're a cuck and you're letting your girl, your wife fuck a bunch of black guys, at least you could be like, I'm not I racist. Mean, I think it's like it's like whatever. It don't matter. It don't matter. It's like it's like if, if, if it's whatever you're into, you know. If if your bitch is getting like fucked by like 15 black dudes and you're like, yes, I love this. Then it's like, hey, you're winning, you know. <laughs> but it's, it's like, well, but right, if she's doing it, and you're like, no, I'm such a cuck. Then it sucks, you know. But if I you, would cry if you like have a bitch that you're not committed to and you're like worried about it. It's like, what is what is worse? Having I your, would never return home. Well, I would I mean, just leave. That, that's, just, why, that's why. That's why. That's why you're not a real cuck like me and Ben. <laughs> You ain't, you ain't really getting on that cuck You ain't living that bad Let's go, let's life go smoke your cigarettes. <laughs> Dude, we're doing a pod. We're, no, we're smoking cigarettes. Right, it's, we're smoking the, it's at 8. The sign up's at 8.30. Take, right. take one of Ben's cigarettes. You're, you're smoking one of his cigarettes. Tim, don't make Nick smoke a cigarette. We can't oh, smoke. I'm gonna make him. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thank you. Yeah, Goodbye. Good one.